Hey guys, this is Big Steph from Iraq124 on the Family TV. If you haven't subscribed, be sure to subscribe, like, comment, and share the videos. This is a video right here of my wife's birthday, which was early this year, July to be exact, 2020. Yeah, it was a nice one. We had it outdoors, had the third, the three zero balloons. It was her, no, excuse me, her, th her three two balloons. It was her 30th, 32nd birthday. She had a good time. We had the cake, everything else set for her. I had the gifts. It was extraordinary. It was filled with nostalgia, happiness, etc. All of the above. It was magnificent. It was amazing. Stupendous. We really enjoyed ourselves. It was a blast. It was so invigorating. For real. I really enjoyed it. I know she did. My parents did. Our daughter did. It was awesome. Yeah, this is the cake right here that I ordered. Unfortunately, I was trying to put it in the fridge and yeah, it, it got smushed together. It really made me down, but it, you know what I'm saying? I had to, you know, worked so hard to put everything together to be perfect that when it happened, it really kind of, you know, made me down. But uh, I tried to keep my head up in spite of it. I wanted everything to be perfect for wifey. You know, I wanted her to really enjoy herself, have a good time. Because that's what it was all about. I also had a great time. Yes, indeed. It just hurt me so much that the kid got messed up. That was one of the things that was a, that was such a disappointment. You know what I'm saying? I was trying to get it into the fridge. It's, the cake is huge, so it wouldn't fit. And we don't have a deep freezer. Otherwise, that would have been perfect for it. You know? So that just just made me feel bad. You know, someone trying so hard to make a, the birthday so perfect for his, you know, spouse. And then the here this blunder comes and ruins, you know, the nice vibe. But we still had a good time regardless. You know, she put the... Um, what do you call that? Basically, it, it, it's it's a replacement for candles, you know. She put it on the cake, you know, and we kept it going, we kept it moving, you know. You don't allow certain things to ruin your day or to, you know to kill the vibe. You gotta keep it going, you know. So it was great. It was great. It was great. It was in the in the mood, getting into the vibe. Full in the groove. Her 32nd birthday. You know, that's my mom right there. You know, see the plates. We used 4th of July plates. Because they were actually on, the, we actually had celebrated 4th of July not so long before my wife's, birth, my wife's birthday. That's my dad sitting right there behind my wife. You know, it was fun. Really enjoyed ourselves, you know. A lot, a lot of thought went into went into, you know, the preparation for for the for the birthday, how we would do it, you know, what it would be like, you know. I really gave it thought, made you know, made sure that it would be something epic, one to remember, you know, because the her birthday before that. Um, she was not here with me, um, in the U.S. She was in Ghana. She was in Ghana. And I'm going to make a video about that so you guys can understand that we were in a long distance relationship for some years. Um, as a matter of fact, it's just been over a year since she came to the United States to live with me. Um, you know... The majority of our relationship, of the years that we spent in our relationship, or as a married couple, have been as, you know, you know, long distance partners. You know, being in a long distance relationship, which wasn't easy, we finally got through it. You know. So she had to order another cake. You know, she she for picture purposes. You know, just to take a 
take a pick of it. Because take a pick of that other cake it really wouldn't be nice. You know what I'm saying? So she had to get another cake from the same place where I got that cake from. But a smaller one. You know, a smaller one. You know, just for the sake of taking pics. You know. Just for the sake of pick, taking pics. For it to be photogenic. You know what I'm saying? You're going to present this pic to the world. That this is a pic of my of of my birthday cake and it got messed up. You don't want that. You really don't. So she had to just order for another cake and you know, you know, just do that for that sake. You know, I understood that. You know, I really put in all the effort to make sure that everything, you know, went accordingly with no problems at all. You know, flawless. Obviously, nothing's gonna be a hundred percent, but you're gonna do as much as you can. You know what I'm saying? To make sure that everything's going to be 100%. You know? You know? So, yeah. It was great. She blew the candles on the cake. You know? While it was in the box. Peep that. While it was in the box. With a big box of matches. So, you know, she had the banner across her, you know, her chest. 32. You know, she had the crown. It had 32 on it as well. And I bought that along with the, the, the 32, you know, balloons. So, so yeah. At this point, my mom is dancing, you know, or playing music. My wife is taking pics. You know. Having a, having a blast. And it's, it's you know, it's, a, it's summertime, so you can just imagine. The weather's beautiful, you know. We're out and, you know, having a good time. Having a good time. I believe it was a, it was a Saturday. It was a Saturday. Um, I actually used my um, vacation time to go to work. And I actually, I actually left for early Friday night because I work at night. And I knew that if I had to leave early so that I can wake up early to get things done. Because if I had worked at the end of the shift, I would have been exhausted and I wouldn't have had the energy to really enjoy the, 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 the birthday celebration. Now here my, my mom is at the grill, you know, cooking the food, getting the food ready. Burgers, fries, chicken. You name it, she's doing it. She was doing it. You know what I'm saying? Flipping the burgers and all that. You know? So yeah, we had a good time as a family. It was a blast. Definitely one to remember. I'll never forget it. And I'll do my possible best to see if I can top that on my wife's next birthday. Once again, this is Iraq 4, Audi Family TV. If you haven't subscribed, be sure to subscribe, like, comment, and share the video. Subscribe, sub subscribe, subscribe. Wifey definitely had a good time. You know? That's my dad and my sister sitting down, waiting to be served the food and the drinks. You know? Why are you taking pics? You know? I think she's holding the... Uh, I got her phone case. She's holding that in her hand. I got her earbuds as well.